Yes, good. It's good evening to all. It's evening again. I'm doing another video to the vault road. I'm going to take you to the Williams vault again. Which is home to the remains of the Williams family for over 300 years. Vault here again, and this is the section of the vault road known to many residents as the car road. And this is straight down the vault road. And this is the history of the vault said it was built in 1660 by General William Asijar Williams. So, this is the, this vault is home to the remains of the Williams family for over 300 years. It is home to the slave owner and slave master of Richmond Hall Plantation. Looking back up to the vault road. And this is the section of the vault road that takes you back to the avenues in Richmond Hall, which is best referred to as the cat road. This is the Williams vault here. So again, I'm in the central parish of St. Thomas in Barbados. St. Thomas is to the center of the island along with St. George. So there is no sea, no coastline in this parish, in these two parishes. These are the two landlocked parishes here in Barbados. Best referred to as the heart of Barbados or the central uplands of Barbados. And this vault is known for its paranormal activity. It said that coffins tend to move about within the vault. There's a similar incident to the vault here in Barbados at Christ Church Parish Church, where they said that coffins move about within that vault as well. It is home to the Chase family. Christ Church Parish Church vault is home to the remains of the Chase family. And they said that coffins tend to move about within that vault as well. This is my family's. This is my neighborhood. My family from my mother's side are from, and they spend lots of time running up and down, playing around this vault as children. This vault was here for so many years. Many children from this neighborhood, many people from this neighborhood, used to play up and down and run about around this vault. And this wall was painted in this peach and white color sometime in March 2020 because of the regathering event that was scheduled to take place for the parish of St. Thomas, but it did not take place because of the COVID-19 pandemic that struck Barbados that same year and around that same time. So all the events had to put on hold, but the, the residents from the vault world get together and put, painted the vault in this peach and white color. Once upon a time, this vault was cracking and had the leaves and grass growing out of it. That's good. So this is the Williams Vault. Yeah, yeah. In the vault road, where it's my house, St. Thomas, which is home to the remains of the Williams family. Mr. Williams, who is interred in this vault, he and his family are all interred in this vault. And he was the owner, he was the slave master and owner of Richmond Hall Plantation. So this, so this is a part of Richmond Hall. The Vault Road is in Richmond Hall, the Williams Vault is in Richmond Hall, but this section is the Richmond Hall is referred to as the Vault Road because of the Williams Vault here. And by the way, the vault is in close proximity to Harrison Cave and Richmond Hall Gully.
the grace for watching now and have a blessed evening.